Transitioning from the dazzling sphere of show business, where the echoes of fame and admiration resonate, the narrative of a captivating and tumultuous journey unfolds. This tale belongs to the actress, Liza Minnelli, who faced the daunting task of emerging from the colossal shadow cast by her iconic mother. With grace and resilience, she navigated the treacherous terrain of the grand stage, establishing herself as a force to be reckoned with amidst the glamour and glitter. Growing up in a family deeply rooted in the world of entertainment, Minnelli was exposed to the intricacies of the industry from a young age. However, the weight of her mother's legacy cast a long shadow, making it challenging for her to forge her path. Despite this, Minnelli remained steadfast in her pursuit of success, determined to make a name for herself and leave her mark on the world of entertainment. Throughout her career, Minnelli has graced the stage and screen with her undeniable talent and unwavering determination. From her early days on Broadway to her iconic film roles, she has captivated audiences with her electric performances and unique style. Her contributions to the world of entertainment have transcended generations, leaving a lasting impact that continues to inspire and influence artists today. Despite the challenges and setbacks she faced, Manelli remained committed to her craft, continually pushing herself to new heights. Through her unwavering dedication and passion for the arts, she has cemented her place in history as a true icon of show business. And so, the story of Liza Minnelli serves as a testament to the power of perseverance, the importance of staying true to oneself, and the enduring allure of the world of entertainment. Liza Minnelli's life began in the radiant glow of the spotlight and has never truly departed from it. Born on March 12, 1946 in the heart of Hollywood, California, she entered this world as the daughter of the indomitable singer and actress Judy Garland and her second husband, the renowned film director Vincente Minnelli. Growing up in such a creative and high-profile environment, it is no surprise that Liza Minnelli was destined for a life in the limelight. Her parents' influence was evident in her early years as she was exposed to the glamour and excitement of Hollywood from a young age. Despite the challenges that came with having famous parents, Minnelli embraced her unique upbringing and used it as a foundation for her own successful career in the entertainment industry. As a child, Minnelli was often on set with her mother and father, observing and learning from the best in the business. She made her film debut at the age of three in the 1949 musical In the Good Old Summertime, starring her mother. From there, Minnelli continued to make appearances in films and television shows, honing her craft and developing her own unique style. Despite the pressures of growing up in the public eye, Minnelli remained determined to forge her own path and make a name for herself. She studied acting at the prestigious New York City's High School of Performing Arts, and later at the Neighborhood Playhouse School of the Theater. Her hard work and dedication paid off, as she soon began to land roles in films and on stage. Minnelli's breakout role came in 1972 with the film Cabaret, in which she starred as Sally Bowles. Her performance earned her critical acclaim and an Academy Award for Best Actress. This classic film, set in 1930s Berlin, showcased Minnelli's incredible talent and versatility as a performer. Throughout her career, Minnelli has continued to push boundaries and take on new challenges. She has starred in films, television shows, and on stage, and has even released several albums. Her unique style and undeniable talent have made her a beloved figure in the entertainment industry, and she continues to inspire and captivate audiences to this day. In conclusion, Liza Minnelli's life has been shaped by her upbringing in the world of Hollywood and her parents' influence. From a young age, she was exposed to the glamour and excitement of the entertainment industry, and she has used this foundation to build a successful career of her own. With her incredible talent and versatility, Minnelli has become a beloved figure in the entertainment industry, and her contributions will be cherished for generations to come. Liza Minnelli's fascination with the entertainment industry began at a young age, taking root in the toweringly iconic studios that surrounded her. The silver screen's allure proved irresistible to the impressionable Minnelli, who found herself captivated by the intricate ballet of filmmaking. As she navigated the labyrinthine hallways and sound stages, the actress became increasingly intrigued by the artistry of the dancers she encountered. In particular, the grace and agility of performers like Gene Kelly and Fred Astaire left an indelible mark on her. Minnelli was particularly drawn to the precision and athleticism of their movements, which seemed to transcend the boundaries of the screen and resonate within her very being. She would often spend hours observing these dancers, analyzing their every step and gesture with a keen eye. 
In time, Manelli's fascination with dance blossomed into a full-blown passion. She began taking lessons and practicing tirelessly, determined to master the craft that had so captivated her. And as she honed her skills, she found herself increasingly drawn to the world of show business, eager to step into the spotlight and make her mark on the industry that had inspired her from the very beginning. Throughout her story career, Manelli has remained deeply connected to her roots in the world of dance and film. Whether on stage or screen, she has continued to push the boundaries of her craft, leaving an enduring mark on the entertainment industry and inspiring countless others to follow in her footsteps. Liza Minnelli's passion for dance and performance was ignited at a very young age. As a child, she would spend hours watching her parents, the famous Judy Garland and director Vincente Minnelli, rehearse for their various projects. It wasn't long before Liza's own talent began to shine through. At the tender age of three, she began taking dance lessons from the esteemed Metro-Goldwyn-Mayer choreographer, Nico Curis. Liza's natural ability and dedication to her craft were evident even at this young age. Her first appearance on film came in her mother's 1949 film, In the Good Old Summertime, where she can be seen dancing alongside her mother. As Liza grew older, her love for dance only continued to grow. At the age of eight, she took to the stage in New York, showcasing her dancing skills as a backup dancer for her mother's mesmerizing rendition of Swan Lake. It was clear that Liza Minnelli was destined for a life in the spotlight. Her passion for dance, combined with her natural talent and the influence of her famous parents, set her on a path to become one of the most celebrated performers of her time. Liza Minnelli, the actress and singer, was greatly influenced by her parents, despite their divorce in 1951. Her mother, Judy Garland, was a renowned actress and singer who had a significant impact on Liza's artistic development. However, Judy's later years were marked by addiction to tranquilizers and alcohol, which led to a series of failed marriages and strained relationships. Despite these challenges, Judy's talent and artistry left an indelible mark on Liza. As a child, Liza would often accompany her mother to the studio and watch her rehearse. These early experiences exposed Liza to the world of show business and ignited her passion for performing. Liza's father, Vincente Minnelli, was also a major influence in her life, as a director, he introduced Liza to the world of film and theater. She would often visit him on set and observe the production process. This exposure to the technical aspects of filmmaking helped shape Liza's understanding of the industry and her approach to her own work. However, Judy's struggles with addiction and emotional instability took a toll on Liza. She faced numerous challenges in her own personal life, including failed marriages and struggles with addiction. Despite these challenges, Liza persevered and built a successful career in film, television, and theater. In her work, Liza often drew inspiration from her parents' artistry and experiences. She paid tribute to her mother in her performance of Cabaret, which became a classic in its own right. Liza's own struggles and triumphs were also reflected in her work, adding depth and authenticity to her performances. In conclusion, Liza Minnelli's artistic development was greatly influenced by her parents, despite the challenges they faced in their own lives. Their talent, artistry, and experiences left a lasting impact on Liza, shaping her approach to her own work and leaving a legacy that continues to inspire and captivate audiences to this day. Liza Minnelli, even from a young age, found herself in the role of confidant to her mother, the legendary Judy Garland. As a result, she shouldered the weight of her mother's emotions, becoming a source of support and stability by the time she reached her teenage years. The actress was thrust into managing her mother's household, taking on responsibilities such as bill payments and staff hiring. Despite the challenges that came with these tasks, an unbreakable emotional bond tied the mother and daughter together. During Garland's mental crisis, Minnelli provided invaluable support, demonstrating a level of maturity and resilience beyond her years. Despite the difficulties she faced, Minnelli remained a devoted daughter, always there to lend a helping hand. As she grew older, Minnelli pursued her own career in the entertainment industry, becoming a successful actress in her own right. However, the experiences she had as a confidant to her mother shaped her and remained with her throughout her life. The challenges that Minnelli faced during her formative years undoubtedly had an impact on her, but they also helped her develop a strong sense of self and a deep understanding of the human condition. Through it all, she remained devoted to her mother, even as she forged her own path in the world of entertainment. In the end, the role of confidant that Minnelli played for her mother was a defining one, shaping her character and leaving a lasting impression on her life. 
Despite the challenges, the bond between mother and daughter remained unbreakable, a testament to the enduring power of family. Liza Minnelli's legacy is deeply intertwined with that of her mother, the legendary Judy Garland. Minnelli has often spoken of her cherished memories of Garland, expressing a fondness for the unwavering support she provided and her earnest efforts to nurture Minnelli's artistic development. One of the most enduring legacies passed down from Garland to Minnelli was her voice. Minnelli inherited not only Garland's vocal talents, but also her mannerisms and unique vocal effects, becoming a vessel through which her mother's artistic essence lived on. This connection was particularly evident in Minnelli's early performances, where she channeled her mother's style and energy. As Minnelli's career progressed, she developed her own unique sound and style, but the influence of her mother's vocal talents remained. Minnelli's powerful and emotive voice, combined with her charismatic stage presence, made her a force to be reckoned with in the world of entertainment. Throughout her career, Minnelli has tackled a wide range of musical genres, from jazz and blues to pop and rock. She has released numerous albums and has performed in countless concerts and shows, showcasing her incredible vocal range and versatility. One of Minnelli's most iconic roles was in the film Cabaret, for which she won an Academy Award for Best Actress. Her performance in the film, which featured several memorable musical numbers, cemented her status as a true Hollywood legend. Despite the many challenges she faced throughout her career, including battles with addiction and personal struggles, Minnelli has remained a fixture in the entertainment industry. Her vocal talent, combined with her undeniable stage presence and charisma, have made her a true icon of American music and theater. In many ways, Minnelli's career has been a tribute to her mother's legacy, and her vocal talent is a testament to the enduring influence of Garland's artistry. Through her music and performances, Minnelli has kept her mother's memory alive, ensuring that her legacy lives on for generations to come. In the early stages of Liza Minnelli's career, the actress made a conscious decision to distance herself from her mother's image. Judy Garland, Minnelli's mother, was a beloved Hollywood star, known for her sweet and innocent characters. However, Minnelli chose to take on more worldly and tough roles in films, opting not to sing Garland songs. One example of this can be seen in Minnelli's portrayal of Sally Bowles in the film Cabaret. The character was a departure from the innocent characters her mother often played, and Minnelli's performance was met with critical acclaim. As time passed, Minnelli came to embrace and feel honored that her audience saw her mother's essence within her. In interviews, she spoke about how her mother's influence was always present in her work, even if she was not singing her songs. In the end, Minnelli's early career decisions helped her establish herself as a talented actress in her own right, separate from her mother's legacy. Her ability to take on diverse roles and her powerful stage presence have made her a beloved figure in the world of entertainment. In the year 1960, Liza Minnelli's passion for performing took center stage when she attended a Broadway musical called Bye Bye Birdie. The vibrant atmosphere of the theater captured her heart, and she discovered a world where she felt an undeniable sense of belonging. Encouraged by successful tours alongside her school drama club and performances in local theaters, she made a life-altering decision in 1962 at just 16 years old. Leaving school behind, she embarked on a journey to New York determined to pursue a career on the stage. Growing up in a family of performers, Minnelli was no stranger to the spotlight. Her mother, Judy Garland, was a legendary actress and singer, and her father, Vincent A. Minnelli, was a renowned film director. Despite her family's success, Minnelli was determined to make a name for herself and worked tirelessly to perfect her craft. In 1963, Minnelli made her Broadway debut in the musical Best Foot Forward. Although she only had a small role, she made a lasting impression and caught the attention of critics and audiences alike. Over the next few years, she appeared in several other Broadway shows, including Flora, The Red Menace, for which she won a Tony Award for Best Actress in a Musical in 1965. Minnelli's success on Broadway led to opportunities in film and television. She starred in several classic movies, including Cabaret, for which she won an Academy Award for Best Actress in 1973. She also appeared on numerous television shows and specials, solidifying her status as a versatile and accomplished performer. Throughout her career, Minnelli has remained dedicated to her craft and has made significant contributions to the world of entertainment. Her talent, passion, and undeniable stage presence have captivated audiences for decades, and she continues to inspire aspiring performers today. Despite the challenges and setbacks she has faced throughout her career, Minnelli has remained resilient and determined. 
She has left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry and has created a legacy that will resonate for generations to come. Her story is a testament to the power of passion, hard work, and determination, and she will always be remembered as a true icon of the stage and screen. In 1963, Liza Minnelli's talent and famous name caught the attention of casting directors, leading to her first major break in an off-Broadway revival of the musical Best Foot Forward. The show premiered in April of that year, and Minnelli's confidence and accomplished stage presence earned her critical acclaim. Her performance in this classic musical marked the beginning of a successful career in the entertainment industry. Minnelli's parents, well-known figures in the world of entertainment, did not use their connections to help their daughter break into the industry. Instead, it was Minnelli's own talent and hard work that shone through during auditions. Her famous name may have piqued the curiosity of casting directors, but it was her undeniable talent that ultimately earned her the role. The off-Broadway revival of Best Foot Forward was a significant opportunity for Minnelli as it allowed her to showcase her abilities on stage. Her confident and accomplished performance earned her praise from critics and audiences alike. Minnelli's success in this show proved that she was a force to be reckoned with in the world of entertainment. In conclusion, Liza Minnelli's first major break came in the form of an off-Broadway revival of the musical Best Foot Forward. Despite the advantages that her famous name may have provided, it was ultimately Minnelli's talent and hard work that earned her the role. Her performance in this classic show was a testament to her abilities as an actress and marked the beginning of a successful career in the entertainment industry. After the conclusion of the show, Liza Minnelli didn't rest on her laurels. Instead, she channeled her energy into recording her first album, which allowed her to share her talent with an even wider audience. This marked the beginning of her touring journey where she brought her unique blend of music and performance to fans around the world. Throughout her touring years, the actress slowly but steadily ascended the ladder of success. She worked tirelessly, perfecting her craft and pushing herself to new heights. With each performance, she gained new fans and critical acclaim, solidifying her place as a force to be reckoned with in the entertainment industry. Musicals were this classic's bread and butter, and she excelled in bringing them to life on stage. Her performances were filled with energy, emotion, and a rare talent that captivated audiences. Through sheer determination and hard work, she became synonymous with musical theater and left an indelible mark on the genre. Her tours were more than just performances. They were a celebration of music and the human spirit. The actress's passion for her craft was infectious, and she inspired countless fans to pursue their own dreams. Her impact on the industry is still felt today, and her legacy continues to resonate with new generations of performers and audiences alike. As she continued to tour, the actress's talent and stage presence became more polished and refined. She became a master of her craft, and her performances were a testament to her dedication and hard work. Her tours were a journey through the world of musical theater, and fans were always left wanting more. In conclusion, following the conclusion of her show, Liza Minnelli embarked on a touring journey that would solidify her place as a legend in the entertainment industry. Through her hard work, determination, and talent, she became synonymous with musical theater and left an indelible mark on the genre. Her tours were a celebration of music and the human spirit, and her impact is still felt today. In 1964, a significant moment in Liza Minnelli's career took place. The young actress, still in the early stages of her professional journey, found herself sharing the stage with none other than her mother, the legendary Judy Garland. This momentous occasion occurred on November 8th at the prestigious London Palladium. Liza Minnelli, barely in her 20s, felt overwhelmed by the prospect of singing alongside a living legend who also happened to be her mother. Fear initially gripped her, but she quickly gathered her courage and let her undeniable talent take center stage. As the spotlight shone upon her, Minnelli proved more than capable of rising to the occasion. Throughout the show, Minnelli held her own, demonstrating her natural ability to captivate audiences with her powerful voice and commanding stage presence. Her performance was a testament to her innate talent and her determination to make her mark in the world of entertainment, just like her mother before her. This classic moment in Minnelli's career was a pivotal one, as it showcased her talent to the world and solidified her place as a rising star in the entertainment industry. It was a moment that would resonate throughout her career as she continued to leave her mark on the world of film, television, and theater. As Minnelli stepped onto the stage that night, she etched her name into the annals of history, joining her mother as an iconic figure in the world of entertainment. It was a moment that would be cherished by fans 
and admirers of both mother and daughter a moment that would stand as a testament to the enduring power of talent and determination. Years later, this moment would still resonate with fans and critics alike as they look back on the career of this accomplished actress and singer. It was a moment that would be remembered as a turning point in Minnelli's career, a moment that would mark the beginning of her journey to becoming one of the most beloved and respected figures in the world of entertainment. In a surprising turn of events, Liza Minnelli's rise to fame was not without its challenges, particularly when it came to her relationship with her mother, Judy Garland. As a successful actress and singer in her own right, Garland found herself feeling increasingly jealous of her daughter's talents and accomplishments. Rather than supporting and nurturing Minnelli's career, Garland instead treated her as a formidable competitor, going so far as to try and outshine her own daughter in their joint performances. Despite the tension between them, these high-pressure situations only served to fuel Minnelli's determination and drive. She refused to be overshadowed by her mother and instead used the competition as a way to push herself to be even better. As a result, Minnelli's performances became even more electrifying and captivating, solidifying her status as a musical force to be reckoned with. One particularly memorable moment came during a performance on a television special, where both Garland and Minnelli were set to sing. In an effort to upstage her daughter, Garland reportedly changed the arrangement of the song at the last minute, leaving Minnelli scrambling to adapt. But the actress rose to the occasion, delivering a stunning performance that left audiences in awe. In the end, it was this unwavering determination and resilience that allowed Minnelli to carve out her own path in the entertainment industry, separate from her mother's shadow. And while the relationship between the two may have been strained at times, there's no denying the profound impact they had on each other's lives and careers. In 1968, Liza Minnelli, the accomplished actress and singer, embarked on her maiden voyage into the world of film. She ventured beyond the boundaries of stage performances, embracing the role of an American secretary to Albert Finney in the British comedy Charlie Bubbles. This opportunity allowed her to showcase her talent and versatility, garnering favorable reviews from critics and audiences alike. This classic film marked a significant turning point in Minnelli's career, paving the way for her next significant role in The Sterile Cuckoo. In this film, she portrayed the character of Pookie Adams, a slightly eccentric and love-starved college student. Minnelli's nuanced and captivating performance brought depth and complexity to the character, leaving a lasting impact on audiences and critics. The Sterile Cuckoo was a coming-of-age story that resonated with audiences and Minnelli's portrayal of Pookie Adams was a testament to her range as an actress. Her ability to bring depth and complexity to a character that could have easily been one-dimensional was a mark of her talent and skill. Minnelli's contributions to the world of film and theater are cherished by many, and her impact has transcended generations. Her performances in Charlie Bubbles and The Sterile Cuckoo are just two examples of the many classic roles she has played throughout her career. These films showcase her talent and versatility as an actress, and they continue to be celebrated by audiences and critics alike. In 1972, Liza Minnelli had the opportunity to showcase her exceptional acting skills in the film Cabaret. This performance was a turning point in her career, leading to a well-deserved nomination for the Best Actress Oscar. This achievement served as a resounding declaration that Minnelli's talents extended far beyond singing and dancing. The film, set in 1930s Berlin, tells the story of Sally Bowles, a British cabaret performer, and her relationship with a young American writer. Minnelli's portrayal of Bowles was both captivating and heart-wrenching, earning her critical acclaim and a place among the great actresses of her time. Throughout the film, Minnelli's character is faced with the harsh realities of life in pre-World War II Germany. Despite the darkness that surrounds her, she finds solace in her performances at the Kit Kat Club. Minnelli's ability to convey the complex emotions of her character while also showcasing her incredible singing and dancing talents made Cabaret a classic that continues to be celebrated today. Minnelli's nomination for the Best Actress Oscar was a testament to her multifaceted abilities as an artist. It was a recognition of her talent and hard work and a validation of her decision to pursue a career in acting. The nomination also served as a reminder that Minnelli was not just a singer and dancer, but a truly talented actress as well. In the end, Minnelli did not win the Oscar, but the nomination alone was a significant achievement. It was a recognition of her talent and a validation of her decision to pursue a career in acting. 
the film Cabaret remains a classic, and Minnelli's performance continues to be celebrated as one of the greatest of her career. In 1969, Liza Minnelli was in the midst of filming her third movie, The Sterile Cuckoo, when she received the heart-wrenching news of her mother's untimely death. Judy Garland, the beloved mother of the actress, had passed away due to an accidental overdose of sleeping pills. At this tender age, Minnelli had to display an incredible amount of strength and maturity. Despite the overwhelming grief, Minnelli took charge of the funeral arrangements for her mother and managed her estate, a responsibility she had assumed from her early years of managing her mother's household. The actress's ability to handle such a significant loss with grace and poise was truly remarkable. Throughout her career, Minnelli has faced numerous challenges, but her mother's death was undoubtedly one of the most difficult tenant yet. She continued to work hard and make a name for herself in the entertainment industry. Her resilience and determination have earned her a place among the most respected and admired actresses of her time. In the end, Liza Minnelli's story is one of perseverance and strength, despite the many obstacles she faced, including the loss of her mother at a young age, she continued to thrive and make a name for herself in the entertainment industry. Her legacy as an actress and a strong, independent woman will continue to inspire generations to come. After taking a brief break from the spotlight, Liza Minnelli, the accomplished actress and singer, returned to work with great resilience in 1970. She embarked on a new endeavor by filming her first television special titled Liza Minnelli, which aired on the National Broadcasting Company. Simultaneously, she began a tour, captivating audiences with her classic cabaret act. The actress's television special was a significant milestone in her career, demonstrating her versatility and talent to a broader audience. The show was a testament to Minnelli's ability to resonate with viewers and leave a lasting impact on the world of entertainment. Meanwhile, Minnelli's cabaret act was a hit with audiences, showcasing her thespian prowess and remarkable vocal abilities. The show was a vibrant tapestry of music, dance, and storytelling, leaving audiences in awe of the actress's talent and artistry. Throughout her career, Minnelli has transcended the boundaries of film, television, and theater, leaving an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Her contributions have been cherished by fans and critics alike, and her legacy continues to inspire new generations of performers. As Minnelli stepped into the world of television and touring, she captivated audiences with her energy, charisma, and undeniable talent. Her work in 1970 was a testament to her resilience and determination, proving that she was a force to be reckoned with in the world of entertainment. In 1971, the actress Liza Minnelli was presented with a remarkable opportunity to showcase her talents in Bob Foss's cinematic adaptation of Christopher Isherwood's collection of short stories, Berlin Stories. The film, titled Cabaret, featured Minnelli as the female lead, Sally Bowles, a cabaret singer, trying to make a living in the ethically ambiguous atmosphere of Nazi Germany during the 1930s. The role of Sally Bowles seemed tailor-made for Minnelli, who portrayed the character with depth and complexity. The film's exceptional score, penned by John Kander and Fred Ebb, provided the perfect backdrop for Minnelli's powerful performance. Foz, a skilled director, expertly guided the actress, drawing out a multifaceted portrayal of a woman struggling to survive in a morally challenging environment. Minnelli's portrayal of Sally Bowles was a testament to her versatility and range as an actress, her ability to capture the essence of a character grappling with the harsh realities of life in Nazi Germany was a remarkable achievement. The film's success can be attributed in part to Minnelli's captivating performance, which resonated with audiences and left an indelible mark on the annals of film history. Cabaret's exploration of the darker aspects of human nature was a bold move, and Minnelli's portrayal of Sally Bowles was a critical component of the film's success. Her ability to convey the character's vulnerability and resilience in the face of adversity was a powerful statement about the human spirit's ability to endure in even the most challenging circumstances. In conclusion, Liza Minnelli's performance in Cabaret was a defining moment in her career, showcasing her talents as an actress and her ability to bring complex characters to life. The film's exploration of the morally ambiguous atmosphere of Nazi Germany was a bold move, and Minnelli's portrayal of Sally Bowles was a critical component of the film's success. Her performance left an indelible mark on the annals of film history, solidifying her place as a versatile and accomplished actress. Liza Minnelli's performance in the 1972 film Cabaret was a pivotal moment in her career, earning her critical acclaim and numerous awards, 
Her singing abilities, combined with a unique blend of toughness and vulnerability, captivated audiences and critics alike. The film, set in 1930s Berlin, tells the story of a cabaret singer, played by Minnelli, who becomes involved with a wealthy playboy as the Nazi party gains power in Germany. Minnelli's portrayal of the character, Sally Bowles, was widely praised for its complexity and emotional depth. Her singing numbers in the film, such as Maybe This Time and Cabaret, became instant classics and showcased her impressive vocal range and control. Minnelli's ability to convey the character's emotions through song was particularly notable and added an extra layer of depth to the film. As a result of her performance, Minnelli received several prestigious awards, including the Golden Globe, the Academy Award, and the British Academy Award for Best Actress. She was also named Entertainer of the Year by the American Guild of Variety Artists. Minnelli's performance in Cabaret remains one of her most iconic roles, and is still celebrated today for its boldness and emotional intensity. Her ability to bring the character of Sally Bowles to life through both acting and singing solidified her place as a respected and acclaimed actress in the film industry. The film itself, with Minnelli's performance at the forefront, continues to be regarded as a classic of the Hollywood golden age. In 1972, Liza Minnelli's career reached new heights with a national broadcasting company television special titled Liza with a Z. This classic show, a taping of her singing act, showcased her unique talent and charm, earning her an Emmy Award. This achievement placed her in a select group of artists who had won a Tony, an Academy Award, and an Emmy, the Triple Crown of Show Business. The actress had already made a name for herself on stage and screen. She won a Tony Award in 1965 for her debut performance in the Broadway musical Flora, The Red Menace. Her film career took off in the late 1960s, and she starred in several successful movies, including The Sterile Cuckoo and Tell Me That You Love Me, Juni Moon. Her performance in the 1972 movie Cabaret earned her an Academy Award for Best Actress. Liza with a Z was a culmination of her success, highlighting her talent as a singer and performer. The show featured her renditions of popular songs, including Son of a Preacher Man and Cabaret. Her energy, charisma, and undeniable talent captivated audiences, leading to her Emmy win. This Emmy Award was a testament to Minnelli's versatility as an artist and her impact on the entertainment industry. She had already left her mark on Broadway and Hollywood, and this award solidified her place as a true triple threat in the world of show business. Her fans cherished this classic performance, and it remains a beloved part of her enduring legacy. In the years that followed, Minnelli continued to entertain audiences with her captivating performances. She released several successful albums, starred in movies and television shows, and returned to the stage for various concerts and Broadway productions. Her talent and impact on the entertainment industry have transcended time, making her a true icon in the world of show business. To this day, Liza Minnelli remains a beloved figure in the entertainment industry. Her contributions to the world of theater, film, and television have left an indelible mark, and her talent continues to resonate with audiences of all ages. Her Triple Crown achievement is a testament to her versatility and enduring impact, making her a true legend in the world of show business. After firmly establishing herself as a star in her own right, Liza Minnelli continued her relentless schedule. This tireless work ethic had brought her to the pinnacle of recognition, and she maintained it for the next several years. She toured extensively, playing venues all over the United States with her one-woman show, Liza. This classic show was the basis for a world tour, which further solidified her status as a leading lady in the entertainment industry. The tour was a massive success garnering her a special Tony Award in 1974 for adding luster to the Broadway stage. This recognition was a testament to her enduring talent and her ability to captivate audiences, both on and off Broadway. Despite the pressures of fame and the demands of her career, Liza Minnelli continued to push herself, always striving for excellence. She was a true professional, dedicated to her craft and committed to delivering the best possible performance every time. Her relentless schedule and tireless work ethic had brought her to the pinnacle of success, and she remained there for decades thanks to her unwavering dedication and her undeniable talent. After achieving such great success, the actress's career faced some challenges. A film titled Lucky Lady, featuring Liza Minnelli, alongside Burt Reynolds and Gene Hackman, was released in 1975. Despite the assembled talent, the adventure film received harsh reviews from critics. Unfortunately, the misfortune did not end there. 
In 1976, a Cinderella-type story, directed by her father, hit the screens. However, the actress's performance was thoroughly panned, with critics describing it as mock and unconvincing. These setbacks were undoubtedly difficult for the talented and dedicated artist, but they did not deter her from continuing to pursue her passion for acting and singing. Liza Minnelli, the actress known for her powerful voice and energetic stage presence, had the opportunity to work with renowned director Martin Scorsese on the film New York, New York in 1977. This 1940s-style musical, co-starring Robert De Niro, seemed like the perfect project for Minnelli, as it would allow her to showcase her singing and acting talents in a role similar to the ones that had made her mother, Judy Garland, famous. However, the reception for New York, New York was not what Minnelli had hoped for. Critics were unkind, accusing the actress of merely imitating her mother's mannerisms and style. The film was also a box office disappointment, failing to attract the audiences that Minnelli and Scorsese had hoped for. Despite the disappointment of New York, New York, Minnelli continued to have a successful career in both film and theater. However, the experience of working on this particular project was no doubt a letdown for the actress who had approached it with such enthusiasm and high expectations. After a series of film roles, Liza Minnelli returned to the Broadway stage in 1977, seeking to redeem herself and reclaim her earlier success. The actress took on the role of a has-been singer in the show, which seemed to suit her more than her previous film appearances. The story revolved around the singer's attempts to make a comeback, and Minnelli's live performances were the highlight of the show. The theater going public, and critics alike were pleased with Minnelli's performance, and her third Tony Award was the Razul Lieutenant, the actress's lively and energetic performances were a perfect fit for the Broadway stage, and her talent for singing and dancing shone through in this classic show. Minnelli's return to Broadway was a triumphant one, and the actress seemed to be in her element in this live setting. The show's success proved that Minnelli was a force to be reckoned with on the stage, and her fans were thrilled to see her back in this domain. The actress's third Tony Award was a testament to her talent and her ability to captivate audiences both on and off the screen. In conclusion, Liza Minnelli's return to Broadway in 1977 was a significant moment in her career. The actress's performance in the show was praised by critics and audiences alike, and her third Tony Award was a well-deserved recognition of her talent. Minnelli's live performances were the highlight of the show, and her ability to connect with audiences on the stage was unmatched. This classic show remains a beloved part of Broadway history, and Minnelli's contribution to the world of theater will always be remembered. Liza Minnelli, an accomplished actress, has made her mark as a recording artist throughout the 70s, 80s, and into the 90s. She has consistently released albums, which have enjoyed strong sales, reflecting the enduring devotion of her fans. Although her recorded output hasn't garnered the same recognition as her film, television, and stage work, it remains a testament to her wide-ranging talent and the loyalty of her audience. Throughout her recording career, Minnelli has tackled a variety of musical styles, showcasing her versatile voice and ability to interpret different genres. From big band swing to contemporary pop, she has demonstrated a unique ability to make each song her own. Her albums, such as Liza with a Z and Results, have become classic examples of her vocal prowess and musical artistry. Despite the challenges of the ever-changing music industry, Minnelli has remained a steadfast presence on the recording scene. Her albums have consistently resonated with fans, who appreciate her dedication to her craft and her ability to connect with them through her music. Her impact on the industry has transcended generations, inspiring countless musicians and entertainers who have followed in her footsteps. In conclusion, while Liza Minnelli's work as an actress has garnered much of the attention, and acclaim, her contributions as a recording artist cannot be overlooked. Her albums have provided a unique window into her artistry, showcasing her talent and versatility as a singer and interpreter of songs. Through her music, Minnelli has created a lasting legacy that will continue to captivate and inspire fans for generations to come. Liza Minnelli, now in her 50s, has built a career that has been marked by both triumphs and challenges. From her teenage years, she has navigated the entertainment industry while dealing with constant comparisons to her legendary mother. Despite these comparisons, Minnelli has managed to establish herself as a successful artist in her own right. Throughout her career, Minnelli has demonstrated her versatility as an entertainer, excelling in various mediums such as film, television, and theater. She has received critical acclaim for her work, 
including an Academy Award for her role in the 1972 film Cabaret. Minnelli's success in the film industry has helped her extend her mother's renown, introducing a new generation to the musical genre that Garland had her greatest triumphs in. In addition to her film work, Minnelli has also had a successful career on stage. She has starred in numerous Broadway productions, including Flora, The Red Menace, for which she won a Tony Award. Minnelli's ability to captivate audiences in live performances has solidified her status as a well-rounded entertainer. Minnelli's contributions to the entertainment industry have earned her a place in the annals of history. Her work has resonated with audiences and has left a lasting impact on the industry. She has transcended the shadow of her mother's legacy and has made a name for herself as a talented and accomplished artist. Throughout her career, Minnelli has faced challenges and has had to work hard to establish herself as an artist. However, her perseverance and talent have paid off, and she has become a more well-rounded entertainer than her mother in many ways. She has extended her mother's renown by giving fresh life to the musical domain in which Garland had her greatest triumphs. Minnelli's legacy is a testament to her talent, hard work, and dedication to her career.